What up guys, it's Sarah with Bulldog Stump and Tractor. Uh, today's project is, uh, again, trying to modify our chicken coop to keep the girls warm. As you saw last time, uh, the girls were in our garage. It got interesting. So you can see you've had a couple of escapes little turns and you can have, kind of see some uh, wet chicken footprints with also more turns. It's that way. I just clean up the poop. Come on. <laughs> Not looking forward to the next cold snap. Cold snap. The girls got some frostbite in their combs and we're trying to figure out, um, you know, putting them in our garage only when it's getting like really dangerously cold, but really just want to keep them outside. So one idea that we had was just to get some painters poly and try to see if we can just wrap the exterior of the run in to help uh, cut down on the crosswind and help, uh, you know, the frostbite issue and the, the wind chill factor. Uh, so Justin went to Menards yesterday and uh, found a plastic drop cloth. It's nine by 12 and our walls aren't nine feet. So what we're gonna start off with is uh, laying this all out and uh, cutting it in half. Tools used for today, a tack hammer, <laughs> that's it. The, the whole thought is just to use the wood structure around the run, put up the poly, staple it in place. Subject for revision uh, two, three, four, or five. So that's what we're going to try today. <laughs> they're not happy right now. Their food and water is really low. Yeah, they're confused. Um, so poly on a run. Take one. Girls, what's shaking? One of you just dropped the deuce because it just reeks. Our garage still smells a little bit of chicken feces. It's okay, you, it's snow, you, you can step on it. So what we're gonna do is um, fill up their feeder, fill up their water and lay some fresh hay down for the girls. They, they really don't like snow as you can see, Noodle. You guys are being a little bit princessy about the whole thing. I don't have any seeds in my hand right now. I can get some pot pile straight up just by, hey, hey, come on, you're ganging up on me. Yeah. They just peck your fingers. Okay. Got food and water. It's the only time they're really, truly ever quiet. Ooh, we got some cleaning to do today. Uh, this is what happens in the winter time. If you don't collect eggs, they will freeze and burst. This one, see how it's kind of bluish? That is a Parmesan egg. She always has like speckles and texture on hers. These olive ones, those are um, noodles. And uh, yeah, definitely got to clean this up. Put down some fresh hay for the girls. They'll appreciate that. Also cleaned out inside of here. They're all hiding in here right now. Hey, you guys like it? I put the second nesting box in here. We forgot it in the garage. You guys are 
doing her eggs in the corner. I think that's a happy noise. Hey, new hay. Hey, hey, hey. I think they're pretty much happy not to like see snow anywhere. <laughs> It's a bench. Yeah, they're like, oh man, this is nice. Does Noodle approve? Noodle doesn't approve of much, by the way. Very hard to please. Checking out the kind of new digs, huh? Slightly new. It's really hard to like shovel chicken poo out when it's this cold. It's just kind of all freezes together. So we just laid some on top. But this gives them at least something to forage and pick through. Hey, farms. Kisses? Oh, you actually did. She's so skittish. See? Alright, so Polly's up. Hopefully that'll make it a little bit warmer in here. Cut down on the possibility of a frostbite. We're going to leave the side facing the house uncovered so we can see in and check on them. I also don't want to fully encase this because I don't want to cause any kind of condensation. I do want some kind of airflow in here, but... Uh, so far, so good. We don't see any negative 20s in the forecast here coming up, but hopefully these girls will be happy with uh, the changes you made and sprucing up their, uh, their run and their coop for them today. Remember, guys, like, share, subscribe. More chicken videos to come as we winter and then as spring uh, comes near, uh, get ready for more tractor footage. Peace out, guys.